Greetings, Tess Daniels here. Uh, another fun part with PBXES really is not um, very user friendly at all. Um, and I'll show you why. For example, um, if I go to my own PBXES URL, which is this one here, um, it asks you for an SIP URI, but if you look in the PBXES site, they don't mention your you don't they don't mention your URI number in anywhere in your user information. So it took me some more time to figure that one out. And what the format is is SIP colon and then the username. In this case, uh, the person who's calling me um, plus their extension at PBX dot org so it does work it just took way too long to figure it out I'm gonna I'm gonna call myself um, and if I click on the audio then I don't hear anything obviously because uh, well I'm calling myself essentially and recording this as well. So that is the SIP. That's the UR, uh, SIP URI format for uh, pbxes.org. It looks like that. All right. Hope it's useful to somebody out there. Good grief. Took way too much time. PBXES, these guys are not documenting worth a darn. Thanks for watching. Happy computing.